everyone, it's Stephanie with Simmerkey, and today we are playing Dream Farmer, a challenge that I created for The Sims 4 Cottage Living. Now I know it sounds a bit weird, but it is a cross between Stardew Valley and Dream Daddy, and I do have the rules linked in the description below if you want to play along. Now I did actually create this series for my Twitch channel, which I play at twitch.tv slash Simmerkey. However, I wanted to share some of the best moments and highlights with you here as well. So without further ado, let's play Dream Farmer. Okay, so we're technically on day three. Oh god, she's hungry. She eats so much. <laughs> Girl, you're lucky we bought some cheese. Let's add some ice and then let's get some leftover cheese. Yeah, I hope it works too. You also get sent to pick up orders since you're 78 to 98% picking orders as well. You zoom. Dang, girl. Dang, girl. <laughs> We're just living off cheese. That's probably why she's so hungry all the time. She's just eating. Friday the cat has been located. Wait, did you lose a cat? What are we talking about? The ponds? Yeah, I'm wondering... Um, it says that the fish are too crafty here for her. Does that mean we have to find a different place to fish or can she keep trying in the same place? I'm sorry, guys. I know some people had a hard time getting the pack. I wish there was more I could have done, but there's, you know, there's nothing I could do on my end other than encourage you to keep trying, contact customer support, you know, go online to like Twitter and the forum, see what other people are saying. Some people said logging in and out helps. Oh, 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 oh is a swiper? Swiper! <laughs> Swiper came to play! <laughs> Swiper! <laughs> Swiper, I love you! Oh, what do you want? What is that? What was that? Are you thinking about cows? Aw, hi, baby! Aw! Baby, I love you. I don't know. Was that a chicken coop he was thinking about? Okay, uh, singing to Swiper makes my life. Oh my god, so cute. Aw, Swiper, you're the best. You're the best, Fox. <laughs> it was a trap, Fox. Oh no, he wants us to get a cow. I want to get a cow too, don't worry. Let's chat about fantastic fo foxes. They were also having outages. I saw them tweet about working, fixing on it. Okay, working on fixing it. I heard that too um, from one of you in chat. So just be patient. Again, I'm so sorry that happened, but be patient and I'm sure they'll get everything fixed soon. Do I have anything else to gift on me? No, I cleared out my inventory. I mean, I do really want to befriend him though. So can we... <sighs> Look at that, sacrificing food for a fox. <laughs> Oh, there's nothing else I can really give him without, like, really hindering ourselves. I mean, I guess we could try giving him some milk. I mean, I do want to be his friend. <laughs> All right, let's give him our milk. We'll keep the chocolate milk. It's nice having a chat. I can actually read. There's too many people in Little Simsies. I'm still new to Twitch, so I'm slowly finding other good streamers. Oh, well, Jan Jan, I love Lil Simsy so much, but I completely understand how it can be overwhelming. So thank you for hanging out with me. Uh, I'm not going to lie. Sometimes mine goes really fast and sometimes it slows down. I think a lot of people are trying to get the pack right now and trying to figure out what's going on or probably playing if they were able to successfully get the pack. So it is a bit quieter here than usual, but I'm really glad that we can hang out and chat. I know. I can't even imagine how hard it is. I've actually... Um, I mean, I kind of come to that realization not too long ago because I'm, I'm not going to lie. I'm jealous of streamers who have a lot more viewers, but I know that I would lose that one on one interaction with you all. And that is the reason that I stream is to have this friendship and to have this community. So even though, you know, more viewers would probably mean like more income and stuff like that, it would also mean that I would probably start to hate it. Like I can't imagine streaming and not being able to really chat with you guys. I would be so sad and I would probably lose interest really quickly and move on to something else. So I'm really happy that we have a small, small ish, still a big community. Um, I'm glad that our community is small enough that we can chat and I can still read most, almost every single comment. <laughs> Aw, Tosi, thank you for the follow. Welcome to the Mermaid Grotto. Joey, all hail our new lurking master. Oh, hell yeah, Joey, thank you for the bubbles. Thank you for the lurk, it means so much to me. That is very kind of you. Thank you for being here long enough to earn 100,000. 
balls and bubbles. <laughs> you had to leave chat. I had to leave because the chat is Hugh. I love it here. Oh, Macy, welcome back. And Heidi, thank you for the follow. Welcome to the Mermaid Grotto. I love you too, Leaf. Monica says, I want to know how people get their swipe on their devices to put in their words they're trying to say. I don't know what that is. <laughs> That's your fear too, Jammy. It's growing stuff in a good way. Thank you, Dee. Okay, Alk, we'll see you when you come back. I watch Simsy streams to watch in hers. I don't care to chat. I just like to watch. Yeah, her streams are so much fun and her community is incredible. I definitely, I love her too. I don't get a chance to really go to anyone's stream anymore, but hers is one of the ones that I used to watch a lot. I used to watch every single one of her YouTube videos. I just don't have time. I don't have time to watch too many people anymore, so I just don't watch anybody, sadly. Yeah, I love her. <laughs> I love her. I used to watch literally every video. I used to watch all of Deligracy's too. I don't even watch barely any of hers anymore. It's hard. It's hard to have time to support every single person that you love. Oh, thank you, Raven, for the mermaid hydration. I appreciate it very much. Okay. Um, the Grubhub order will be here soon. All right. So I'll keep an I'll keep an ear out to see if I hear anyone coming. Oh, she's hungry again. I literally have to figure out some food options, guys. I don't think the cheese is filling her up. Rocky, my sweet friend Vampy, is sending me Subway. I'm so excited. I'm so excited. Uh, it's when you run your finger across the letters and it knows what you're saying. It's supposed to be faster. Oh, I've never done that before. Did anyone see the photo Lil Simsy posted of her and Dan? No, I heard about it. Someone in here earlier said that they, they... Was it about the ring? I can't remember now. I'll have to go check. I think so. Swiper, where are you going? Yeah, the only thing is she doesn't have a skill to catch fish yet. And every time I try to make her, she keeps stopping. So I'm just going to see if we can just keep queuing up this interaction over and over. It looks like they're letting her fish here now, though. Sometimes it says that she's not, she doesn't have the skill to do it. No, it says it looks like the fish are too crafty. Try fishing elsewhere. I think that literally means elsewhere. Okay, oh, but we need to eat. Oh, this is getting rough, guys. <laughs> let's go ahead. Let's make sure we add ice. I guess we'll just keep eating the cheese, even though it's not filling us up. We'll eat the cheese. Let's go ahead and breed our frogs to make a little bit of money here. So we have two $10, okay, all $10 frogs. Let's get rid of that one. Maybe once you're at level two, you can fish in your own pond. I think so. I think we're going to have to go to the Bramblewood anyway. So let's have her eat so she doesn't starve to death. And we'll send her to the Bramblewood to get some uh, fishing skills in. Okay, let's see what that cheese actually does. Probably, see, that's the thing. The cheese doesn't fill her up. Can we have some milk or something too? I mean, we have money. It's not like we can't buy food. I'm just trying to be careful. Um... Let's try the milk. Milk, we're drinking you. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. You're in a bag. You've been waiting for a year and a half arrived. Um, <laughs> I mean, yay, a year and a half. Utensil preference, that is for a snowy escape. Oh, I love that she's drinking chocolate milk. <laughs> we gave her other milk to the fox. Bass is calling. Um, I'm not going to answer because we have to go fishing. Sorry. Really, Caitlin? I can't wait to go see them. Aw. <laughs> All right. So the Bramblewood is this area back here. So let's head. Oh, no. We're not supposed to go to New Henford on Bagley. I forgot. We are here already. So old New Henford. That's what I'm trying to say. So where's another fishing spot nearby? Oh, it was a Kickstarter and they had delays. Oh, okay. Oh wait, can we, f no, where can we fish? Can we go to our neighbor's pond? <laughs> our neighbor's not that far. I thought they were farther. Can we fish in the river? Uh -huh. Do you guys see anywhere? This isn't like the other worlds. I imagine you could fish in the river, but maybe not. Look how high these rocks are. 
So I look for fishing signs. I don't know. Doesn't look like we can click on it. What about here, right by the park? Oh, here, here, here. Oh, okay. All right. Okay, okay, okay. This works. Let's send her over here. It's literally across from my house. I never saw this. <laughs> I saw the sign and it opened up my eyes. I finally saw the sign. <laughs> it's literally across the street. <laughs> right there. It's right there. <laughs> We've been fishing in this pond with no luck all this time. That's the problem. The color is the same as the grass. That's why I don't like the green water. <laughs> Jeez. City girl can't even find her way around the country. <laughs> She can navigate those city streets like it's nothing, but she literally can't even see across the pond. <laughs> MBS, thank you for the follow. I know, I better not get DMCA'd. <laughs> it's not a real British pond or river. It should be brown. Oh. <laughs> ah, finally, we can fish. That's all it took. <laughs> Are you going to go swimming? Where did she go? Did she just glitch? Look at the little swans and the duckies. Those are the swans, right? Or are those the ducks? I can't remember. I think those are the ducks. Where did she go with her swimsuit? Uh, <laughs> what is going on with her face? <laughs> I don't know who this is. <laughs> Uh, her versus hotcakes. Who wins? I, I say hotcakes. This is the one instance that I'll pick hotcakes. <laughs> hotcakes, you're back on the list. <laughs> uh, what are we gonna clump of weed? A seaweed. <laughs> Who's Corbin? Is he one of the daddies? <laughs> Maybe, maybe it's hot cake, sister. I definitely got their makeup skills from each other here. <laughs> she hates fishing. Oh, that's awful that she hates fishing. Listen, I don't care. No, go, don't talk to her. <laughs> well, too late. <sighs> too late. We have a friend now. <laughs> You're supposed to be fishing for food, not making friends with clowns. <laughs> I know, she doesn't like fishing. I feel bad giving her squeamish now because we literally need her to fish. Oh wait, did we fish all this stuff up? Oh, this was from complete. Oh, this was from completing our, our challenge. Oh, because we fished here, so we got the rewards. Okay, okay. Uh, I believe you had a proper look at the local landscape. If you're wanting even more to do, I might suggest popping out in the Bran Bramblewood. It's a bit of a trek, but the scenery is straight out of a fairy tale. Look for the creature keeper who lives out that way. By the way, he may have some errands to keep you busy. And don't forget to attend Finchwick Fair on Saturdays. There's a various friendly competitions that take place when you can best your neighbors. It's judged by yours truly, so stay on my good side. Okay, so we got some rewards from her. We completed one of the tasks. The other one was to find the package. I think we have to go back to Town Center to do that. So, wow, we have food though now. Oh my gosh. Let's go. We have animal treats and berries and wool. Let's sell the wool for some money. And then let's cook up a fishy. Hey, Doug, if you get a chance, can you see if my food came? A what? Can you see if my food arrived? Um, I'm going to go ahead and go ahead and cook the fish and then we can put the berries and stuff in the fridge. Guys, Daddarky's going to check if the food came because I did get a message that it was close, but then I never got a completion message. And I always get scared when they do that, but it doesn't ever arrive. So he'll take a look outside and see if there's anything there. Okay, we're going to put these in here. Can we put the animal treats in there? No, but the animal treats might be able to go into our new chest that we haven't used yet. Yes. Okay, that's a gr <sighs> Thank God those go in there. Can we put our earbuds in there too? No, we can save those for fun. And then that means we can cook a little fishy. How do you cook a fish? Add log, extinguish, marshmallows, play. 
add log, marshmallows. There's not even hot dog. Play guitar, sing song, play, admire, and extinguish. I, I wonder if it's something wrong with this particular fish because the hot dog option isn't here. It might be because we have the simple living trait. All right. Well, this was a waste of a bunch of money. Um, that sucks. You need the fire fruit from Island Living? That's to cook whole meals. Can we grill the fish up here? Power doesn't work off the grid. A different fire pit? Yeah, the fish didn't have an option. Just add mount or name. May I think it's because we have off the grid. But the fire pit shouldn't... No, it shouldn't be affected. I did it in Rack's Riches. It has a cooking skill. Drag and drop? No, it's you You um click and then you click cook or grill that's just not working hmm we're losing money every time we do that i don't know how much money we started with though so i don't know what to put it back at i wonder if the new pack items are counted as ingredients rather than whole things you can cook that's what i'm wondering because when i played rats riches i didn't have this yeah, I think we were somewhere around twelve fifty. Let's just put it back to twelve fifty. I don't know. I don't know. Let's just sell the fish because I don't think we're gonna figure it out. And then, um, a swarm of bees. How? We're indoors. <laughs> How? I'm inside. <laughs> it's because of creepy crawlies. I'm literally inside. How did they get in here? <laughs> Y'all, she's gonna die and starve to death. I don't even know what to do at this point. <laughs> can we can something? No. <laughs> can we can fish? <laughs> can we cook something? A fruit salad. All right, there we go. We have some fruit. We're gonna make a giant fruit salad. <laughs> Let this girl finally eat. <laughs> All right, while she's doing that, I very happily am i gonna eat my sandwich that bit vampy sent me oh girl you are so kind i love you so much great now she's hungry again <laughs> oh no did i oh god 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 i left my fruit salad out and it spoiled and we're being attacked by plasma bags y'all y'all <laughs> This is not going my way. <laughs> yeah, it's not the fishing sign. She just doesn't have a skill high enough to fish in the pond. <laughs> I can't believe we didn't put that in the fridge. Why? <laughs> Please tell me there's something else we can cook. Please. All right. Well, luckily we still have some cheese. <laughs> oh, boy. Now what? Eat your cheese. What are you doing? <laughs> Go eat in front of the fridge? <laughs> you have a perfectly good table to sit at. What are you doing? <laughs> uh, she's just going to be miserable. She's going to just wallow in her own pity. <laughs> she can suffer. All right, guys. Chocolate chip or macadamia? I'll let chat decide. She's going to turn up. Yeah, she's going to end up turning into cheese if we don't stop feeding her something other than cheese. Chocolate chip? All right, chocolate chip it is. Subway cookies are always so soft. Mm. Wish Doc would read it. Read what? We're showering in our bucket. Oh, you can eat spoiled food as long as you don't eat the last bite. Really? They won't get sick when you do that? How come nobody told me that? <laughs> what? Okay, well. I mean, we'll try woodworking. This is just going to cost more money than we'll make at the beginning. Let's do a horse sculpture. Mm. 
I just have to figure out the package thing. Oh, okay. Are you still here? I have a new fox we can name. Abby Anderson. Uh-oh. This is our fault for giving all the foxes our food. Should I do it again? You're learning all kinds of things today. Me too. <laughs> no, come back, Abby. Okay, she's back. It's like you have to eat the whole entire meal in the city in order to learn it. Oh, uh, okay. There's more bugs on the crabs. Oh my God, why is my life like this? <laughs> I literally give up. I don't even know what we're gonna do, guys. We're gonna need a better game plan for next time we play, like seriously. We're gonna need a better game plan. Otherwise, we're gonna be just poor for the rest of our lives. <laughs> She's gonna hightail back to the city and go back to her old job just so she can make ends meet. She's gotta pee again too. We literally just peed. Oh no, John, welcome back. I don't wanna shoe her. I don't have a gift to give her. Oh, I can't, I can give her the wooden sculpture we just made, okay. <laughs> At least she's happy, not really, she's miserable. <laughs> You know what? The fox always wins. We're going to go broke taking care of these foxes. That's what's going to happen. You better. Oh, she didn't even like it. She didn't even like it. She put her thumbs down and she ran. You don't even have thumbs. <laughs> you don't even have thumbs. She thumbed me down and ran. Uh. <laughs> Watering the plant. Watering the plants, watering the plants, watering the plants. <laughs> that fox was just rude as hell. I'm not happy. <laughs> this is, I don't know why this is harder than Rags to Riches. At least with Rags to Riches, I had a freaking plan. I don't know what the hell I'm doing. <laughs> yeah, oh, you missed it, Kay. I had a fox for you to name, but it ran away. It ran away. I don't know if he'll come back. We'll let you know if it comes back. No, 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 no. I didn't even know Rowan. I'm literally going to cry. I'm literally, that is so sad. Why on earth would they do this? I didn't even know this fox. This is so disgusting. Why? I didn't even know him. How dare you? How very freaking dare you, The Sims? How very dare you? Well, that is so disgusting. Oh my God, no. I didn't even know him. No, 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 no. Yeah, it just keeled over and died. What the hell? I didn't even know him. I thought we had to have a relationship. That is so sad. I am so sad. Why would they do that? Why, literally, why would they do that? I didn't even get a chance to give them an aging treat because I didn't even know they existed. An anti-aging treat. Oh my God, this is so sad. No, 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 no. Foxes don't die. Guys, foxes don't die. No. No. Nope. Nope. No. Grim, you suck. You literally suck. You literally suck. <sighs> okay, please name Abby because I need to hug this fox now because that just made me so sad. Okay, I got a new fox for you to name. <laughs> You love this pack so much. I do too, but I hate that that just happened. She she officially hates it here. She's officially ready to go back. Mac Chi Chi. Okay. A fox died. Yeah, so he's just getting teleported to another realm. That's all. So sad. <laughs> They're with Gerald now. <sighs> I guess that's some consolation. I don't know. Jeez. Oh, wow. Abby ran away. That was fast. We got her just in time. Nope, nope. She's back. I mean, not Abby. Mac? Gigi? <laughs> Let's chat about foxy vulpines. Oh. She's like still spraying for bugs. She's gonna run away. 
Matt, come back. We're done now. Matt, come back. Now we're done and Mac is gone. Off into the distance. We missed him. <laughs> Thank you for the hug, Lee. I could really use a hug right now. Like, she's still in good spirits, but my gosh, this is just awful. She's literally, she's literally over it. She's literally over it. And she's angry. I don't blame her. I'd be angry, too. And she really has to pee. <laughs> Sims who are exposed to things they dislike for an extended period of time will slowly be driven mad. Oh, I forgot. We said that she doesn't like watering plants. Can you change that at any point? I think in cast, maybe. <sighs> Y'all, we made this too hard. We literally made this too hard. We did not think these things through. <laughs> she hates fishing. She hates watering plants. <laughs> A fox just freaking died. <laughs> this is a hot mess. Hot cakes is here. She needs a farm boy to garden. I think so. Bree, thank you for three months of love and support. You are so kind. I love you so much and I appreciate you. Bree, with a bippity boppity boop boop of your snail. You are now a seahorse of corn. Yeah, she's living off cheese. Now her sink broke. <laughs> She's trying to scrub the toilet. She's a neat freak. She hates it. She literally hates it here. <laughs> it's okay, Brie. Thank you for that love and support. You can pop it up as many times as you want. <laughs> we'll just blame hotcakes. Oh my goodness. And she's hungry. Surprise, surprise. She's hungry again. No. No. What, what just happened? If that's another fox dying, I swear to God. Does she like handiness? Um, she dislikes handiness. Yeah, she dislikes it. What just happened? Is this a community garden? Did the fox just show us a community garden? Was that just a gift from the gods? Did he steal something? I don't know why it focused on the fox. Your Sims likes and dislikes cannot be any worse for this challenge. I know. <laughs> oh, these are dead plants. Is this, com is this community garden? Where did this come from? Is this someone's house? No! <laughs> so much going on oh my gosh my sim's not even here she literally ran away <laughs> to try to get some free food in a disgusting garden where all the food is rotten because we made it too difficult we gave her the squeamish trait which means that she won't go fishing she hates fishing and we need to fish to make money i accidentally well not accidentally but i was trying to go along with the story and i said that she didn't like watering plants so now she won't even want to garden we have no money we caught one fish no we got a fish as a reward for running an errand and i've been trying to cook it and i think it doesn't work with the combination of the off the grid and the simple life tray she, she can't even cook the damn fish she's just been eating cheese and it doesn't even fill her up and she's starving and then right before you raided us a fox died like we didn't even know this fox the camera just refocused to him and this elder fox just and his like his mouth was just like and now i'm gonna cry i was literally gonna cry <laughs> Okay, we're gonna go to town and see, oh my gosh, there's another errand that we could do to earn some money. And it's trying to find out who has the mayor's missing package. I feel like this is an Animal Crossing errand. Um, but yeah, we're gonna talk to some counties, see if we can figure it out. And I'm just gonna have to bite the bullet and get her some food. <laughs> I'm trying to save money because we created this challenge today and we can't do any upgrades or furnishing or anything until we have at least 10,000 simoleons. So I've been trying to like hoard every single one and which is we're not we're losing money like crazy. <laughs> we're literally losing money like crazy. 
All right, let's ask that villager if they have the package. Someone's got to have to have this package. You mean it should run Sims 1? Your Sims was tired all the time, though. Did you play Sims 1 all day today? That's so cool. Aw. <laughs> I'm sorry about your Sim being tired. My Sim just can't even catch a break. Uh, it must be really hard to be a Sim. It must be so hard. <laughs> It was? Oh my goodness. I can't. I, I tried to play Sims 2 and I couldn't. I started with Sims 3, so I get it. Like, I understood how the Sims work. But when I tried to play Sims 2, I was like, I don't know what to do. <laughs> They're constantly uncomfortable, that figures. Well, Avery, thank you so much for the raid. I seriously love you so much. Like, I understand if you need to go or if you want to hang out, I would love that as well. Whatever you want to do, I just appreciate you bringing your friends and bringing your community. And it means the world to me. Like, seriously, thank you so much for sharing the love. And if you all want to continue our awful day with Willow, <laughs> please feel free to hang out. She's got to eat, though. We got to get her to eat. Oh, don't tell me the grocery stores, stalls are closed. Why are they closed? Are we literally too late again? Man, where can we get some food around here? Okay, the pub, the pub. <laughs> what was your suggestion, Nick? You might, oh, you might have to put it in chat. I think I missed it by now. <sighs> Will has been uncomfortable most of the day, too. This is just so bad. We're supposed to be dating our dream daddy farmer, and we can't even survive. <laughs> All right, what's something really cheap? I know we could do the chips for free. Should we be a cheap ass and just get the free chips? I think we should. Thank you for all the follows. Thank you everyone so much. It means a lot to me. Yes, thank you, John. So the backstory, um, <laughs> ooh, we got a discount. I mean, we got free food, so. The backstory is that this is Willow. She was raised in the city, um, but her grandparents passed away and they left her a farm, much like Stardew Valley. <laughs> and she has no idea how to run it. So she's moved here to Henford on Bagley. She's trying to figure things out. She has this idea that she's gonna fix up the place and sell it, but she didn't realize how bad it was. And so she's stuck in town for a bit, trying to figure out what the heck to do. And unbeknownst to her, we have a dating series going on as well. So if you want to create a farmer for her to date, you can put them on the gallery with hashtag farm, dream, dream farmer, dream farmer. And we're adding your townies to the world so that hopefully she finds someone and falls in love and decides not to leave the country. She should have went down to the Jojo Mart path. I know, I know, I know, I know. We picked the wrong path. Look at her. She's like, God, I hate gardening already. I hate our, I hate planting stuff. I hate it all. <laughs> Wait, what, Junie? 30K what? Aw, thank you, Kagiri. I love mer. I've always loved mermaids. Thank you. Followers? Who? <laughs> What are you talking about? Me? <laughs> Me? <laughs> when the fuck did that happen? I thought we were so far away. What? <laughs> no, are you kidding me? <laughs> How did that happen? <laughs> when did that happen? <laughs> Holy mother of pearl! <laughs> Thank you all for 30,000 followers! What? <laughs> I have no idea! <laughs> I don't even know we were close! <laughs> and Maisie, thank you for redeeming a shout out. Everyone, please go follow Macy and Nay. Thank you for the follow. <laughs> Oh my god, thank you guys. That's perfect timing. Because technically tomorrow is my three year partner anniversary, but we're celebrating on Monday. So 30,000 for three years. That's insane. What a crazy goal to hit, literally, on my anniversary. <laughs> thank you. I love you all so much. Thank you. Thank you for the love and support. It means the world. Oh my gosh. <laughs> I know, I don't even know what's happening. So much is happening. <laughs> Thank you, Sarasness. I didn't even know you were here. Hello, my love. Thank you for everyone's support. Oh my god, 30k. <laughs> it's not a real number. <laughs> That's quite literally not a real number. I don't even know what that means. I can't even count that high. <laughs> 
Wow, thank you all. Oh, thank you for the lurk. It means a lot to me. I hope you've been enjoying our hot mess of a let's play today. <laughs> At least she finally met her knight in shining armor. Pumch. <laughs> This could be one of your townies. I don't even know. I don't know who's under this suit. <laughs> it might have been a rough day, but we met our knight in shining armor. <laughs> oh, Dylan, I'm so glad you like the bag. <laughs> oh my goodness. Can we do something special for chat? Can we give everyone 3,000 seashells for hitting 30k? That That's incredible. I would have been keeping an eye on the count if I knew we were even close. <laughs> Thank you, Milk. I love you so much. You guys are so sweet. Thank you for all the love over the years. I've been so incredibly lucky to have such an amazing community that has supported me for so long through everything, even through the long Sims break that we took. So thank you everyone who's new, who's been here since day one, who's been here for however long. You all have help create this incredible community and I couldn't have done it without you. And I'm gonna get emotional now. That's literally crazy. <laughs> I was confused why no one was talking about it. Do y'all just look at my view count or my my follower count? Like I haven't even looked at it in weeks, months probably. I didn't even know we were close. <laughs> oh. Katie! Oh my god, thank you for the bits. I love you to bits. Thank you, Katie. That's so sweet. You're obsessed with my greeting cards. Thank you, Kagiri. Oh my gosh, y'all. Thank you. I do have an Etsy shop. <clears throat> I make greeting cards and stickers and bookmarks and all sorts of fun stuff. Thank you. That means the world to me. I mentioned it a couple days ago. Did I? I had no idea we were even this close. I, th I thought we were literally like, I don't know, hundreds away. Th not a thousand away. I thought we were hundreds away. <laughs> I had no idea that was coming. Yeah, my hair. My hair sunset colors. Yep. <laughs> Holy smokes. I mean, I mean, we got 51 followers today. That definitely helped. <laughs> so thank you, y'all. I switched from mobile to PC when I clicked on you. That's when I saw. Oh, really? When I clicked on you. Oh, cool, Junie. Wheel spin? I mean, I was going to give you all 3,000 seashells. Do you want a wheel spin too? <laughs> oh, you mean for the follower goal? Yes, you're right. We'll do a wheel spin. Yes, Jan Jan, I sell stickers. I have, um, I'm sorry I'm not playing The Sims, but y'all, I had no idea we were this freaking close. Um, I sell stickers on Etsy. There's single ones like this. And we'll do a wheel spin and you have a chance to win one. Uh, we've got our channel mascot fin. And then I also sell sticker sheets. All right, guys, I don't even know what we were doing or where we were. <laughs> Okay, thank you, Milk. I appreciate it. And you're not slow. You do a great job. Let's ask this guy for help cleaning. I don't even know who these people are. Is this one of our dream daddy farmers? I don't even know. <laughs> I think she. Yes. Oh, you're right. No, no. We ate chips. We ate chips. Oh, God. It's one in the morning. I mean, she seems to be having fun, but we are going to have to send her to bed soon. You keep getting a bug that's not letting you move Sims into other households through gameplay. Oh, I'm sorry. I don't know. I don't know about that one. I don't know about that one. <laughs> All right. Well, I guess we'll send her home. I mean, it's really late. We can just fast forward through the night real quick. I still don't know what we're going to do for like a, a regular source of food. We might have to just do a grocery delivery because it seems like every single time I get to town, they're just closing. Well, Zoomer, is Zoomer's broken or did we say it was fixed once you got cottage living? I'm not sure if we could do the food delivery, but I guess you we're just going to have to buy groceries, guys. I don't know. It's going to be hard to get to our 10K, so let's make a new plan. New plan is we'll just buy some groceries and we got to figure out a solid way to earn some money. Um, I don't think crops are going to be it. I mean, maybe. Mm, I don't think the fair is going to be it because that's only once a week. I really think oh, fishing's not going to work because she's squeamish. Should we just get her a damn easel and have her start painting? <laughs> I don't know. We don't have a knitting box and we made a rule. Oh, no, we can't get an easel either. We made a rule that we can't buy anything until she hits 10K. Should we rewrite the rule challenges? Because this is hard. <laughs> this is hard. <laughs> 
We might have to rewrite the challenges. We don't have, we didn't give her any hobbies. I did not think I had. I gave her nothing. I gave her nothing. <laughs> she literally has, the, we even had to cheat a bookshelf because I wasn't thinking. A temporary job. No, there's got to be another way. Dumpster dive? Maybe. <laughs> no rewriting, just improvise? <laughs> well, that's what the errands were doing, but they're kind of, they weren't going quick enough. Crap, she's hungry again. Use aspiration to change her traits from squeamish to something else. Yeah, I feel like that's kind of cheating though, you know, because she's only been on the farm for like four days. Could she really have gotten it over it so quickly? Um, I'm going to be writing out the version after the stream, Kelly. I had no idea we were going to do this. We were just coming up with a new Let's Play idea and it like turned into this challenge. So I'll type everything up nice and neat and I'll put it on my Discord and on my Twitter. Twitter is at Simmerkey and my Discord, you can get the link by doing exclamation point Discord in the chat. Aw, thank you all for the 30k hype. All right, so this is for the custom command. Uh, you can make it say almost anything. <laughs> type 30k hype if you want a chance to win a custom command in our chat. All right, let's go ahead and order, thank you Milk for doing that. Let's order some groceries. The internet doesn't work without a supply of power. <laughs> to death. We're gonna starve to death. This is the hardest challenge in history. Why did I impromptu create the hardest challenge in the history of this game? This isn't even fair. This isn't even fair. Look how tense she is. She's so tense. Literally gonna die on this damn farm. Grandpa, you left us a death trap? You literally left us a death trap, Grandpa? No wonder why he died. Grandpa starved on his farm and left it to <sighs> Oh my god, I'm so over this. We should have stayed in the city. <laughs> no wonder why the fox died. It's desolate out here. <laughs> There's nothing for us here. <laughs> okay, let's go to the grocery store. She's hungry. She, why does she eat so much? She never stops eating. <laughs> she literally never stops eating. <laughs> He's buried under the melons. Where do you think we got our fertilizer from? <laughs> Yeah, plot twist. It's a horror movie. <laughs> oh, no, okay. I didn't mean change your traits. I mean earn the points. Oh, okay, okay. <laughs> Hannah! Is there a dumpster around here? I don't think there is. You have to have eco lifestyle. <laughs> Hannah, thank you for two months of love and support. Oh, look, the goths are here. <laughs> Is Bella's blush always that strong? <laughs> oh my god, Hannah. Happy two-month anniversary. Thank you so much for subscribing. Not once, but two times. That means the world to me. Thank you for helping support me in my dreams. Flowers? I don't even know where there are flowers. All right, Mel, go ahead and roll the winner for, winner for the custom command. <laughs> all right, groceries, groceries. I gotta, I gotta stay on track. I gotta focus. This time I'm not giving all my groceries to the fox, okay? I don't care how cute the fox is. I'm not giving him my food this time, all right? Not giving him my milk, not giving him my chicken meat. I'm not giving him my horse sculpture that I could have sold. The fox is nothing but trouble. All swiper does is swipe, that's all. Arcane, congratulations, you won the giveaway. Yay! All right, Arcane, you're gonna get your very own custom command. Make sure you get with one of the mods to help you out with that. And thank you so much, Milk, for doing that giveaway. Aw, thank you, Hannah. That makes me so happy. Nope, next time we're not giving our lactose free beef Wellington to the fox. <laughs> it's a trap. <laughs> All right, let's get some milk. Let's get some carrots. Uh, I'm gonna skip the cheese this time. Let's get a cherry. Let's get a few eggs. Maybe we can make eggs and toast. <laughs> Fire milk. Oh, we don't need anything spicy. We have flour and sugar. So what else do we need to cook? Maybe I just didn't have enough veggies and such. We can get some milk bread this time. Um, 
Ah, I'm really afraid to get the fish, but maybe we can make fish tacos or something. A potato should be something we can cook with. And some meat. All right, y'all. I'm spending 200 simoleons. We're still left with 1,000, so we're okay. But oh my gosh, let's go home and cook. I don't even... Oh, wait. I need to figure out who has the package while I'm here. Do you have the package? Who has the package? Does anybody have the package? I don't know how we're supposed to figure it out. Do the Goths have the package? Hey, Mortimer, I'm looking for a package. Do you have the mayor's package? <laughs> the mistakes have been made. Lessons have been learned. I need to find you in this challenge to make it not so difficult. I'm going to put notes to remember to like uh, have a hobby and to have a money making source. You know, let me do that now before I forget. I'm just going to write a note down. Make sure to have hobbies and money making source before exiting build mode. Do not make my mistake. All right. Carrie, thank you for the follow. Welcome to the Mermaid Grotto. Thank you for joining. And once again, for anyone new, hi, hello, welcome. My name is Stephanie, also known as Simmerkey. I'm a self-proclaimed mermaid obsessed with the Sims. Hi, Drac, thank you for the follow. Welcome to the Mermaid Grotto. <clears throat> I love seahorses, unicorns, rainbows, kittens, and the color pink. And today we are playing Cottage Living. EA Game Changers is very kind to give me early access and pre-early access. So I've, I've had the pack for a bit now, but, <clears throat> but there's so much to uncover. Like literally, there's so much to do. Cottage Living has been really, really fun. I'm normally a builder, and so gameplay for me is extremely difficult, but we're chugging along with our new dream farmer dream daddy sturdy valley crossover let's play challenge that we created <laughs> i'm losing my voice after all that five more subs for a wheel spin uh oh uh oh elk uh oh all right let's go ahead and discuss local, local fishing spots i really need to see if any of the interactions come up i think they have to actually live in henford on bagley to be able to ask them if they have the package because I don't see any of those interactions. <clears throat> That's all you can eat, cheese. Yep. Pretty much. Use the woodworking table. Um, We were trying, but... Guys, I'm not going to lie. I gave my first woodworking sculpture to the fox because he was so cute and I had nothing else to give him. I know the first few times we do it, we're not going to make money. And our priority is to eat, so... <laughs> That will be like a later thing. Like right now, we really have to come up with a solid money plan. And I know that if we find out who has the mayor's package, we'll get some rewards. I'm just not sure why it's not working. Like we used to be able to ask everyone if they had a package. And now, either we asked everyone already. Let me see. What? When did we get the package? <laughs> Y'all, I need a break. <laughs> when did we get the freaking package? <laughs> oh, and the interaction doesn't work anymore. We already got the damn package. We already got the damn package. This is our bucket. <laughs> I'm not going to lie. I haven't ended yet because I've been trying to get this package for the past hour. It's going to end so much sooner. I was gonna end so much earlier, but I really wanted to get the package. <laughs> Not at the whole time. <laughs> oh my god. Okay, wait, wait, hotcakes is here. Nope, she just disappeared. <laughs> yes, yes, we will, we will. We're not allowed to have any animals though. We can befriend them, but we're not oh god, there's a bear. We're not allowed to have any animals until we hit 10k. I'm going to rewrite these rules. They're way too hard. All right. Oh, my gosh. Deliver the package. Jesus. I did. <laughs> fun. <laughs> Lots of fun. <laughs> now I'm having fun. <laughs> All right. Let's deliver this damn package. The fox had it, probably. Hey, look. There's one of the dream daddies. <sighs> That better be a good reward. What do we get? What do we get? I don't even know what we got. 
Uh, one of the best things about living in Hanford and Bagley is the sense of community. Everyone helps foster. Thank you for checking in with a few of the locals. Don't be a stranger. Okay, so I think we got, ah, some Yorkshire pudding. We got some upgrade parts and a fish. No, we bought the fish. Is that all we got? <laughs> a rip off. <laughs> Willow is Lavina's faring friend today. Oh, she gave us more. Oh my God, she gave us a meat pie. Lavina, you literally saved me. I'm starving to death. Thank you. <laughs> oh, how wholesome. She gave me a pie. <laughs> wait, 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 wait. The Spice Festival is somewhere where we could go get some crops. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on, we're gonna take our good friend Hotcakes um, with us to go get some spices at the Spice Festival. We can get a baby cow plant and we can plant it and then sell it or we can keep it, but I probably will sell it unless you guys wanna keep it. <laughs> but it, it's really hard to take care of. I can't even take care of myself. I don't know what we're gonna do with a cow plant. <laughs> Aw, well thank you. It's worth more selling it as a seed. It's actually worth more planting it. If you sell it as a seed, uh, I think it's worth a couple hundred. If you plant it before it's full grown, it's worth like 450. And then if it's full grown, it's worth like a couple hundred again. Something like that. Oh, wait, wait. Can we get another autograph from Britani? <laughs> the Perlomo, um, Simmer Key Hype. Oh, Simmer Key Hype Annie, A and I. You sold it for 170, I think. No, the cow plant, I sold it for like 450. Cause I waited till it was a little baby. If it's a baby cow plant, it sells for more. Okay, please give us your autograph. Yay! Okay, she gave us her autograph. Let's get that appraised. Hey, hotcakes, what's up? Let's describe a new idea. Tell a joke about professors. Oh, okay, Lynn, go get some rest. And then I'm just gonna source as many of these plants as I can and steal some food and go home. I'm gonna, there we go. We can get all these, harvest strawberries, harvest all. All right, so this will give us some money and some food and I finally feel like we have a fighting chance. We were at the lowest of low and then we found the incredible package that saved our lives from our knight in shining armor. <laughs> And our friend Hotcakes is just here for the ride. Heather made her. You can tell Heather thank you for making such a lovely creature. <laughs> All right, we can sell this for 300 simoleons. Woohoo! Making that money. Oh, look, we finally almost have what we started with. No, did we start with 1,000 or 1,500? Maybe we're not doing that bad. I think we started with like 1,000. I think we initially had 1,500 and then we put it down to 1,000. Uh, Cecilia says, I hear the festival t-shirts are out of this world. Let's go buy one. Nope, I'm broke. But we are going to steal all this food. We're going to pack a few sack lunches. They don't last for a really long time, but we'll at least take some with us so we have some options. Yeah, I think we usually only gave her 1500 and I was like, this is too much money. And we put it down to 1000 but I probably should have kept it at 1500 Look at, is this... <laughs> Is Bob Pancakes checking out our butt? <laughs> I'm pretty sure. Or he's mad that I'm stealing food. Either way, he's side-eyeing us. <laughs> all right, I'm taking all this home. All, it's all mine. I'm stealing everything. Oh, Bob. Is there a guide to this game? I feel like it's in depth and I'm playing it wrong. So cottage living itself, kind of, I mean, there's not really a guide, but if you talk to the townies, you can learn about the lore about the town. You could get errands to run and things like that. <clears throat> but I'm making a let's play. And so I have a challenge that I created today and I will be putting those into a nice, easy to read format. Cause right now it's just a bunch of scribbles and I'll put that on my Twitter account at Simmerkey and I will put it in my discord channel under the Sims challenges. Uh, tonight or tomorrow. I don't know when I'll get a chance to do it, but if you want to do my challenge, you can. It's a cross between Stardew Valley. Hey, did you try to steal my food? Hey, Judith, you owe me a picture. You owe me a picture. 
<laughs> That's a cross between Stardew Valley and like Dream Daddy, I suppose, or Bachelorette, Bachelor, Bachelorette. We're basically going to be finding a dream farmer and settling down in Henford on Bagley. Jen, thank you for the follow. Welcome to the Mermaid Grotto. Appreciate having you here. Are you going to give me your autograph? She said no. You literally stole my food that I stole. <laughs> You stole my food that I stole, and you won't even give me your autograph? Witch. <laughs> I never do community-made challenges, but I'm going to do this one. Aw, thank you. Yeah, did I already upload her? I can't remember if she's on the gallery. If not, I'll make sure to do that. Okay, she's hungry. Let's grab a serving, and then let's go home, because this is, this is a day. <laughs> this has been the longest day. <laughs> No, don't act like you can't sit down. There's food everywhere. You better eat now. You better eat now. Be complaining about food for a damn week. There you go. Eat your food. Mmm, whatever that is. Uh, companion, thank you for the follow. Welcome to the Romain Grotto. Judith is rude, but at least we got Brittany's signature. I know it's Brittany. Are you really going to walk all over this damn festival before sitting down? You started here. You started here. <laughs> Oh yeah, my sim is on the gallery, I remember. If you do hashtag farmer, dream farmer, you'll see hotcakes and you'll see my sim. Are you gonna freaking eat? What are you doing? <laughs> oh my gosh, she's gonna be the death of me. She's gonna be the death of me. <laughs> eat your food. Eat your damn food so I can send you home. Eat your damn food. Eat your damn food. <laughs> you're getting hungry while you're standing here. Your hunger is going down because you're not eating your food. Why, why are you sad? Who, who is this random person you're talking to? Oh my gosh. <laughs> Wait, sit down. <laughs> oh, I'm going to kill her. I'm going to kill her. I'm going to kill her. <laughs> She's, we're murdering her in the Sims murder party on Monday and this let's play is over. <laughs> That's it. She has to go. That's it. <laughs> she has to go. <laughs> no, no. It just said she took her first step on the culinary journey. So she finally ate. You know what? I don't care if you piss yourself. We're, I'm going to let you to the bathroom. We're going home. 